What if I told you that almost everything you learned about women in ancient science is missing a crucial name? Not just a mathematician, not just a philosopher, but one of the greatest minds the ancient world ever saw. Here's the truth the West rarely talks about. Hypatia wasn't like the scholars before her. While many philosophers kept their knowledge secret, she taught openly at the Library of Alexandria, attracting students from all over the Mediterranean. She mastered mathematics, astronomy, and philosophy, writing commentaries on Euclid and Ptolemy that clarified their most complex ideas. Alexandria was in turmoil when Hypatia rose to prominence. She reformed teaching, advanced the study of conic sections, and built scientific instruments like the astrolabe. Her lectures drew Christians and pagans alike, united in respect for her intellect. But Western history reduced her to footnotes, ignoring her genius. Why? Because acknowledging her brilliance meant admitting a woman led the greatest minds of her time. Most scholars bowed to politics. Hypatia stood for reason. She debated bishops, counseled governors, and led with logic, not superstition. That wasn't arrogance. That was courage. Hypatia wasn't silenced because she was dangerous. She was silenced because she was powerful. A scholar beloved by students, feared by zealots, and erased by history. If you believe Hypatia deserves her true legacy, comment Respect Hypatia or Brilliant Mind, and don't forget to like and subscribe for more hidden history.